Cavani is loving this, soaking it up, really enjoying his entrance. And he looks game, he looks up for this. As does his opponent, Sheikh Al Bessi. I think Al Bessi fought in Birmingham, trying to recall. Bani making his debut, so it'll be interesting to see how he gets on. Bani, the body snatcher. Can we take anything from the nickname? Is he like Dylan Ryan, the body snatcher? Will he take El Basi out to the body? Will be very intriguing to see if he can live up to the nickname. Shaif versus Bani for 80 kg like heavyweight bout here in Oldham. We've had an amazing card. I feel tired from watching these guys go to work. It's been an incredible night of action. It really has. It's been amazing. Value for money is definitely value for money for all the crowds. Sure. You don't even get, you know, in all honesty, you don't even get professional shows just good. with this much action. Exactly. It's been amazing. Both calm and collected, no need to stare each other down and no animosity really between the two. But he's changed very hard for this money. So it'll be interesting to see how he's getting up, get some. Bunny looking good with his jab and his stance is very impressive. Clinching and Shive coming with a hundreds of punches straight away. Trying to sort of answer back to uh, Bunny's stiff jab that he left let off in the first minute or two. Sorry, another, first another fast start though. Yep. I think every I, I, fight. I think you have to though. It's a three round yeah. fight. It's Too hard to settle round. down. A three round fight is hard to settle down. You don't really know it, you know, how the scoring is being done. You kinda have to start off fast to make sure you get um, the correct decision. Jeff has thrown a lot of punches already in this fight. Well, that was mm. to the back of the head. He's not letting yeah. Bunny have work at a distance. Closes the gap very quick. That's what Bunny needs that distance to let his shots go to work off the jab. And that's the crowd behind Bunny that. It's interesting actually because as you said that he needs to work with his jab to keep his distance. Yes, he is a taller fighter and that's exactly what he needs to do. You're completely correct. But you see as soon as uh, Shaif comes forward, Bunny seems to get a bit emotional and uh, starts swinging, leaving his chin open, which he doesn't need to do because he's good enough to stick to stick to a game plan. Yeah, I think Albasi has done well to smother Bunny's work so far, so it's been good. But it's been an interesting first round. In the round one here in order. Assam with some stern instructions there for Bunny, telling him to step out, use his range and box off that. Unlike he should, he's got ability to box. Second round between Bunny and Shafe. Tough round to score that first round. Correct, both show quite similar ability and both had kind of similar output of punches. And similar success throughout the first round. Bunny listening to his uh, corner very carefully, getting behind his jab, keeping the distance. And let's see if he follows the instructions over once. He's flinching with the jab, he just needs to let it go a little bit. Back in shape up well there. Yeah. Very little one round two. So this is where he doesn't need to get emotional, yeah. he just needs to stick with good combinations. That's what happens, he gets caught and he slows back down and he's back to square one. Bunny wants to trade with him when he gets closer, I don't think he has to. He could win this fight easy, boxing on the back foot. But Good combination there from Shaif as he goes to the body, back to the head. And both of these Warriors absolutely going for it here in round number two, not holding back. So it's going to empty their gas tank for sure and Bunny gets caught with a brilliant one-two from Shaif. Credit to their gas tanks. As I say, that both of them stop in the middle of the <laughs> yes. ring and give each other a cheeky smile. How's this round gonna finish? 
Last 10 seconds, both going for it still. Shaif is against the ropes and Bunny still hasn't done too much to the body. I want to see him go to the body. <laughs> yeah. He hasn't, he hasn't gone, he hasn't done the body snatcher as he's not gone for the body. Just it's another hard round to score. Yeah. down to the support again, you know, support does make a massive difference, the referee can't always, or the judges can't always see what is landing exactly, so when a fighter throws the shot and the crowd goes crazy, you can almost score that off the crowd's reaction, mm -hmm. so you kind of want to edge it towards Bunny, and he has looked more composed of the two. Bunny just... Keeping his distance this time off. Oh. And he gets caught with a stiff jab and then another stiff left hand. Shaifan trying to dig into the body as they get into the clinch and the referee separates them. Similar round to the round number one and not, number two. Not much not clean landed again, yes, yeah, smothered again. Don't think their styles of gel at all, but Lot. As I say, that shot catches. Uh, uh, that's what Bunny needs to do. He needs to let his shots go off the ropes. Again, the one two on the ropes. This right one. here, he needs to get away from him and let his shots go. But Bunny keeps him in close when he doesn't need to do that. Very true. He gets caught with another shot there. Bunny was really, that was really impressive just a few seconds ago what he did yeah. over that side. That's what he needs to do more of. He needs to keep him on the keep him on the end of the jab. I think the ball feeling the pace of this a lot. Interesting end of the fight. Bunny's putting everything, leaving everything in the ring. He's not stopped punching for the last 10 seconds. Brilliant end of the fight. And he's put, you I can think, tell. I think Bunny's nicked it. Yeah, I think he has as well. But he put absolutely everything in that last round, Bunny. He was not leaving anything outside of him. He made sure everything. He threw absolutely everything he had at that. And I think he may have just nicked that.